Winter has arrived in Delhi, but so has the pollution. Luckily for me, I have the Maruti Suzuki Jimny 4x4 with me and I'm making a run towards Rishikesh where the air is fresh and has adventure in it. So let's see how the tale of this trail unfolds. Now I am on my way to the mountains, but there is still the small matter of what the Jimny and I should do. Luckily for both of us, Rishikesh has enough challenges and adventure activities, so let's try and see how much we can pack in a single day. Well, here I am in the beautiful valley of Rishikesh and behind me you can see the Ganga flowing. Now, while this river is one of the most significant in our country, I am of course geared up and here for an adventure apart from taking the Jimny off-road, which of course is river rafting. So, I've got my fingers crossed because the Ganga seems pretty chilly and the rapids also look really fierce. Hoping for the best and going in now. Well, that was some mental fun on the Ganga and I have to say that I'm also feeling a lot better about myself because now even I have done some hard work apart from the Jimny that has been using it 4x4 to take me to all these scenic locations. Now the best part is that I still have a lot of the day left. So let's see what more can we do. After successfully crossing the rapids of the Ganga, I thought to myself, why not try and go over it? And that is what all this new gear is hinting towards. So let's check that out. You might be thinking, how do you cross over Ganga? Well, you don't cross, but you fly across on a zip line. And this is what I was talking about. I'm going to be zip lining across the Ganga. And let's see how that goes. Now a quick update on how the Jimny has been performing on these very rough mountain roads here in Rishikesh. Well, I have to say that it is no problem for this SUV because this is actually its natural element and that is exactly how the entire package has been performing. The suspensions are performing great, the engine has enough grunt to take on very steep inclines and even the brakes are performing really nicely. Add to that mix the K15B naturally aspirated engine, well it offers ample of low end torque and that is the kind of performance you need when you are on a gravelly inclination or you know a very steep hill. Overall I have not been uh, asked to engage the 4x4 at a lot of occasions but when it arises I know that I have the whole arsenal of the Suzuki all-grip all-wheel drive system to back me up here. Armed with the 50 years of legacy that the Jimny has in the off-road segment, I was confident of tackling all the challenges that may come our way. And it is not only the rough mountains and the very serious off-road trails where the Jimny performs like a champ. Out here on the open highways also, this is a pretty good SUV to be inside because the car is very comfortable and the NVH levels inside this cabin are very well contained. Above all that, the car is also pretty efficient and I suspect that I can get back to Delhi on the full tank that I had when I left from the capital city without having to refuel. Well, what a day it has been. 
from off-roading with the Jimny to rafting to even zip lining, I have certainly had an action-packed day. And I would like to say that all the credit for this trip goes to the Jimny, which I will be explaining shortly. So it has been quite an adventurous day out here in Rishikesh and now me and the Jimny have finally reached our resting place for the night and uh, I have set up this campfire here and uh, I do not think that there is any other better way to end such an adventurous day. Well that was my day out here in the beautiful valley of Rishikesh and as mentioned earlier I would like to give most of the credit to the Jimny 4x4 because it is the charm of an SUV like this which convinced me to leave my comfort zone behind because it is really difficult for a person like me with a 9 to 5 usual job to leave their home behind and do something so adventurous and so spontaneous. But having a car like this in your garage of course encourages you to take that step and I think that is why we call such machines lifestyle SUVs. Now after such an action packed day, I am pretty tired but the Jimny can still keep on going because as we saw the car can really take a beating. I took it through streams, through very extreme off-road trails and the car did not relent and that is the kind of reliability and robustness you would want in a lifestyle SUV such as the Jimny. Boy, that is a tale I will remember for a long time.